Alright, hello guys, this is John Center 95 again. Same day I filmed my uh, my trick lighter video. Um, actually just a couple hours later. Um, so I was sitting here in the garage, bored as usual, thinking of stuff to do while shooting my Lego crossbow here. Razor blades into cardboard. And I was thinking about my air cannon, that I have these rounds right here that they usually go straight sometimes they tumble but they go really 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 far really fast and hit very hard hard enough to go through half inch plywood so I thought why not make them um, aerodynamic I know you're thinking how did I get that out of shooting crossbow stuff but I was shooting pencils and stuff and they were tumbling in the air and I didn't want them to tumble but same thing happened with my air cannon so I went to my air cannon and made this it's uh... hold on these flights folded up it's very simple same round you see in most of my other videos. Same thing. All I did was add zip ties on the end in four uh, opposing directions. And I just shot it once out of my air cannon. And it made this awesome... I don't know how to explain it, but when you hear something go through the air very fast, like that searing sound, like it's like... Tsh, it made that sound. And it went so straight, like didn't drop an inch or anything like that just went stuck into my uh, plywood and went right through it um, all the way back to the nut right here um, so now I'm going to film this and show you guys what I'm talking about just how straight it goes and give you some ideas for your own air cannon if you have one otherwise just watch this and you'll be very entertained Alright, here's the damage right after I just shot this guy, which was the second clip you saw. Um, this one down here, fully penetrated. And um, I'll show you why I did that in a bit here. If I can ouch, get it out. Well, I'll just push it through. Alright, that's a good idea. So we'll find that. And then this didn't fully penetrate because... Yeah, that's half inch plywood by the way. It's obviously old, but it's not rotted. Didn't penetrate all the way because I have that other piece of wood right there. And there's our other round down there. I'll pick that up after I show you this up close real quick. But this is how it is after the shot. Flight's kind of folded, but they still do their job. Um, it's an easy fix just after you shoot them. Fold them out or whatnot. And there you go. You're back to perfect flight alignment. Before we go on to the next clip, I just want to show you the damage it did. I put another piece of half inch plywood because if you heard me say, oh no, in a very concerning matter, it um, penetrated about, I don't know, let's see, what is that? Half inch plus three eighths inch. I hate math. Whatever. Probably 75% of an inch of wood. And almost went through my fence so don't tell anyone uh so here's the next clip all right we are shooting through one inch of plywood there are two half inch sheets stacked up next to each other with very little holes in them 
and there's a tree behind it so I hope I don't go through all that stuff <laughs> so here we go we're gonna shoot Glory to God in the